What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John from The Gamer Dude here. Welcome to you back to another episode of Dang and Ropa Goodbye Despair. Um, I should say Dang and Ropa 2 Goodbye Despair. In the last episode, um, we had to talk to Kazuichi, and we had to sit, give her hair, to be triggered, because Kazuichi wants to freaking go see girls and be cringe um and i don't really want to do that that's just not who i am that's not the person who i really ever am so i'm like this is gross and i don't really want to do this but oh, unfortunately the game is gonna make us and you know of course i'm saying this in like a rude ish manner like oh, the game is gonna make us and i can't believe it is gonna happen but i gotta realize that <clears throat> we are a stereotypical man who likes chicks and all of that. Oh, gosh, we cheat. Oh, my God. Looks like they're going to Chandler Beach. Right. That's We gotta head over to the diner first. Our plan is to be at the beach before they get there. Yahoo, I'm excited. I'm not at all excited. Yeah, we're so ready to go do this. Uh, why? Why in the world are we being forced into this? Alrighty, the ladies aren't here yet. Let's hurry up and go inside. Why? Ugh. Also, I ordered some soundproof, uh, some soundproofing materials, so that'll get here overnight. So I really didn't need to record this today when I did, but I am I'm, I'm, I'm interested in what's gonna happen. AKA, when I get soundproofing materials, I don't want a John Triggered episode. So, yeah. All right, we're here. Now, just with a stake out a spot and wait until the ladies arrive. Is he sure about this plan? I mean, isn't this a little too stalkerish? It's Kazuichi. This has been stalkerish from the get. And when they come, did you happen to overhear that with your sensitive ears too? Or, and when are they going to come? Did you happen to hear that with your sensitive ears too? They mentioned something about coming a little after the sun starts to tell. So maybe around 4 p.m.? It's 3 p.m. right now, so we have to wait one more whole hour. <laughs> Anyways, make your move early. That's just the basics, you know. Hey, um, I don't know if I should be talking like an expert right now, but um, it's fine. It's fine. Just make sure you keep watch of the window. It'd be bad if I didn't catch Miss Sonia on the way to the beach, you know. It's our job to keep that from happening. To get to the beach, they've got to pass the front diner of the diner. You better keep your eyes peeled. This isn't a game. If this isn't a game, then what is it? I really should have said, just said no. Yeah, you really should have, Hayame, but you did it, and now we're here. Sitting at the table by the window, I rested my chin in my hands and absentmindedly stared out the window. Me, real me, would be just hoping that Nakamaru would show up out of nowhere, but knowing that wouldn't happen. Are they coming? Do they arrive? It hasn't even been 10 minutes yet, dude. 20 minutes passed and then 30. As time passed, the only things that grew were the volume of my size and the weight of my regret. <sighs> Say, what kind of swimsuit do you think Miss Sonia will wear? She's a, since she's a foreigner, how about a bikini? Don't you feel like there's a little, there's a pure innocent mystical, fa don't you feel like there's a pure innocent mystical fantasy hiding between the top and bottom of a bikini? Even if I wanted to agree with you, I don't even know how to answer that. Wait, um, and that's when it happened. In the corner of my eye, a certain someone walked in the front of the diner. Huh? Isn't that? I wonder what happened. I guess I should head over. We left the diner in a hurry and ran to where the person was standing. Who? Is it Nekamaru? Oh my god, it better be Nekamaru. Oh! Huh? You bastards. I knew it was you. I knew it was you, Fuyuhiko. What are you doing here? That's my line. Hey, hey. What the heck? You're awfully tense. Actually, why do you seem so flustered? Who are you calling flustered? Don't make any false accusations, you bastard. Don't tell me. Oh, man. Is that it? You overheard my plan, didn't you? Huh? P plan? Huh? It's no use playing dumb. You overheard my plan and follow us all the way here, right? Hello. Hey, uh, what are you doing at this place? Oh, That's a strange combination. Hello. Um, hello, um, 
Today is another wonderful day. Um, well, you're, done for. you're not gonna get away now that I've caught you. Wow, I got so nervous I ended up blurting out something weird. But please don't hate me. I'll take a, the punishment as much as you like. Aww. Oh, um, you two. This is such a coincidence. Um, I never expected to coincidentally run into you guys here. He really does suck at this. No, he seriously does. He's like, I'm gonna go like talk and be in this spot with the women because the women are the women and blah, 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 and I'm a horn dog. And I'm like, okay, I get it in a way. I can't say I don't because if I didn't say I, if I would be lying if I said I didn't understand. <sighs> Nekamaru. Anyway, um, I don't, un I don't, I'm not saying I don't understand, but I would definitely go about this a completely different way. I'm not gonna just like awkwardly be like, Run, like awkwardly try and run into them like i need i'm one of those people that things need to happen organically and i'm not gonna force the issue now if somebody wants to force the issue with me i might be a little weirded i i honestly probably would be a little weirded out um but i don't, I don't know like that's my thing because i feel like what you're not you're doing the opposite of what you're wanting to do like i know some people want the attention and the validation Part of the uh, validation comes from the attention, but this is not who I am. Anyway, well. man, actually, Hayame and I were about to head to the beach together. Oh huh, could that be what you ladies are here for? That's such a coincidence. It seems like destiny. Aww. Something's obviously suspicious. Your eyes are moving around like salmon before they lay eggs. Oh. No way, I'm always like this. Um, How should I put it? Um, I always pay attention to my surroundings. I can't keep watching this. Can we just, like, go? As I sighed, I looked away from the embarrassing sight. I realized he had disappeared. Huh? Where did Fuyuhiko go? Well... Well, uh, regardless, you two have arrived pretty early. It's only 3.30pm. You still have about 30 minutes until you meet the others. Um, why do you know we're gonna meet with the others? Why you? And you even know our damn meeting time! Hmm. Well, you see... Anyways, let's cherish the coincidence that brought us together. <laughs> so, it is okay if we join too. Wow, he got forceful all of a sudden. Aww. Ah, so that's your ulterior motive. You're probably here for Sonya, ain't ya? I, I, I really have no desire to do something so rude, like decline an offer at all. But Sonya was the one who planned to go to the beach, so we need to ask her first. Of course. Then it's all good. It's too devastating to think Miss Sonya would decline, so, um... I just won't think it. Is he being an optimist or a pessimist? I don't really understand. Hey, hey, hey. hey is it all right if we go inside now? Abuki was gonna eat food, a good meal. That's why we came early. <laughs> sure thing, let's wait inside. I can't take my mind off of Yuhiko. Oh well, I've come this far. I can't turn back now. I want to. I really, really want to. Can I talk to the seagull? Because the seagull has more of a freaking brain than Kazuichi. Um, no, I'll talk to Mikon. Mikon, I need your help. I always want to say something stupid when I get nervous. <laughs> I'm not doing it on purpose. I always say something. You're not saying something stupid. If anything, Kazuichi is. Army, an army marches on its stomach while swimmers only splash around on their stomachs too. I'm gonna eat a hearty hamburger with a side of rice. Is this rice a side dish? Wait, is there even rice here? Let's go back in the diner. I returned to the diner and sat myself at the table near the window once again. Whew, not thinking I couldn't help but let out a big sigh. <laughs> Oh, what are you going to do about your swimsuits? You aren't allowed to change at the beach house, you know? Uh, yeah, yes, that's why we're already wearing them. <laughs> What's underneath the uniform isn't panties, it's a swimsuit. Of course. Well, that's obvious. I also came wearing my swimsuit too. Huh? Really? Uh. Which reminds me, you're not wearing yours yet, huh? Then you got to go to the bathroom so you can change. Here, I got this. Here you go. This is yours. Um... I respectfully decline. What is this thing? Um, it may be rude of me to say this, but that 
looks a little too daring. I agree, Mikan. Okay, I agree. There is only there is no actually I don't even no no I no I wouldn't even let Nekamaru wear it. Okay. Like, I know that I was like, oh my gosh, it's so crazy. I actually got my ideal thing situation. No. Nekamaru, once Nekamaru and I were, like, got together, there would be no way I'd be letting him wear this kind of stuff. Because I'm sorry. Um, I'm a shorts kind of guy. Like, uh, no, and I mean, like, like the, the, oh, uh, God, that sounds weird. Um, like, the swim shorts kind of guy. Like, I don't, I'm not, no. This is no. This is just big no. Um, you know, just, just No. Exactly. I agree with Mikan. All of this to say I agree with Mikan. Anyways. Are you serious? What if something falls out? If this thing is... If this is airing live, you're totally going to get censored by the network. <laughs> Don't worry. Even at my worst, it won't turn it into a live-action drama. That's not a problem. What is it then? Are you telling me you don't want to match with me? It's... It's matching? Then I definitely don't want to wear it. Exactly. That's even more awkward. Um, I believe fighting is bad, so, um, let's stop, please. <laughs> Things are heating up. Quite the... F heating up something fierce when everyone is going to come. I hope they come soon. And as she said it, Abuki peeked out the window. Oh. Huh. What is it? Look outside, look outside. What's outside? Everybody else. Oh, wait. Isn't that Kyoko? Jeez, don't get my hopes up. I thought it was Miss Sonia. Doesn't she seem a little strange? If I had to describe it as a song title, it'd be Sprint of Tears. Huh? It looks like she's running from the beach. Did something happen? Despite our questions, Hi Hiyoko ran in front of the diner at full speed. Huh? She totally ran past us. Wasn't she part of the beach crew? Uh, apparently she can't swim, so, so she turned us down. Hmm. But she... Didn't she just come running from the beach? I, I, am the, I don't know all the details about that. <laughs> well, it just means that women are full of surprises. Mahiro is the type to totally come, but she's uh, surprisingly turned us down too. Mahiro? She did? She turned it down? It's super unexpected of her not to join an event like this. In fact... She'd totally be the one planning this sort of thing. Totally it. But it can't be helped. Apparently she wasn't really feeling that well. Um, I'm terribly sorry to continue this topic, but why is Hiyoko crying? Why are you asking us? What if she was sprinting away from the beach and crying? Something's definitely wrong. Hey. Whoa. When did you get here so suddenly? Kazuichi suddenly shouted and what he was looking at near the diner's entrance. As I turned around... I thought if I came early, I'd be the first one to arrive. <laughs> Not what I was expecting. Couldn't keep myself from staring like an idiot. Whoa, Chiaki. You came wearing only your swimsuit. I didn't want to carry it with me. If I did, it'd be a serious burden. Serious burden? That's a total exaggeration. Even though you didn't want to carry anything, it looks like you're carrying something. Instead of bringing lunch for everyone, I brought ice cream. Um, it's not my thing's gonna turn it down, but ice cream is completely different from lunch. I don't think it can be used as a substitute. Also, I was thinking of stuff we could all do at the beach together. So I brought a board game too. Hmm, should we play it even though we came all this way to go to the beach? Nah. I am like, okay, so I get what Abuki's saying. I totally do. Because the whole point is to go to the beach. But like, Chiaki. I would play board games with... I, like, here's the thing. The fact that the ultimate gamer... This this shows me that the ultimate gamer is not just video games. And they're talking about, like, other games as well. So that I would love to play board games. Like, board games are my th another one of my things that I like to do all the time. So I would totally, like... Spend the day doing that. I see. That's disappointing. I'll play with games with you. It's fine. <sighs> but how should I say this? This is a Gatmo. Is this what Gatmo is supposed to be? 
for someone normally so for someone so normally normally so quiet to wear such so, such so, for someone normally so quiet to wear such a daring swimsuit, it makes me feel a little excited, right? Right, Hayabe? Um, well, um, I don't know. That's what I said, but my heartbeat actually goes getting faster and faster. <laughs> Seriously, man, I never expected Chiaki to have such huge jo- Really? This is- What happened? Don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. Honestly, don't. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! I didn't say that just now. It was Hayame. He's a pervert, you know. You are dumb, Kazuichi. I fucking hate you. What are you saying? I mean, oh, I only have eyes for Miss Sonya. I've dreamed of going out with that blonde lady ever since I was a kid. The size is a little small, but this is was the only swimsuit that fit me. Hey, hey. I, I don't look good in it. Huh? Well, no. I guess you look good. Thanks. Then I'm glad. I I guess. <laughs> <laughs> wearing a bikini is sure daring. And you get bonus points for wearing a white one. My heart is just not just thumping. It's thumping all sporadically like ba-dump, ba-dump, thump. But dump 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 ba dump It's probably a heart attack. Hey, I kept you waiting. When we heard the voice, as the we heard we heard a voice as the diner was slowly opened and the person who walked through was Sonia. No Akane! Hey, sorry to keep you guys waiting. Why are you bleeding, Sonia? Or not Sonia, Akane. Something wrong? I made sure to wear a swimsuit this time. Not that! Be your rules! It, it wouldn't be strange if we nicknamed you Carrie right now! Uh, oh! You're talking about bees. <laughs> On my way over here, I happened to run into Coach Nekomaru. And when that happened, I gotta fight him, you know? What? Why, why does she have to do that? Are you really alright? Your head! It looks like it's split in half! Well, it'll heal as long as I rub some spit in it, right? Oh my god! You're totally playing up the power of human spit! It's more like, why would you do that in the first place, Kazuichi? <laughs> I'm all fired up now! I never knew such a strong opponent even existed! He's mine! Anyway, you, you need to be treated, and you also need your wounds sterilized. Akane, please come with me. With an unusually forceful demeanor, Mikan pulled Akane to the bathroom. Let's go, Mikan! Like, I appreciate the fact that she was like, nope, I don't care what you have to say. I'm going to do that. This is the Mikan that I really want to see. The Mikan's been super passive and super, like, I don't know. I'm so scared and blah, 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 blah. And like, I get that her specialty is this. And so the fact that she's like, nope, I'm going to do this. This is what's going to happen is super awesome. <laughs> That's why she's the ultimate nurse. Well, it's going to be okay if we leave it to her. Yeah, it will be. But the fact that she's hurt by Nekamaru, I'm going to have to tell him to freaking calm, his, calm himself and take out of his aggression on me because honestly, that's fine. But because there's a different kind of aggression and... You know, it's it's a again, it's a different kind of aggression, and he can scream at me all he wants to because honestly, I'm weird like that, and don't mind it. Anyways, moving on. What is all this ruckus? All right. Oh, who is it this time? Paco. Hmm? Hajime, Kazuichi, why are you two here? Hey, aren't you breathing pretty heavily? I just did a little swimming. A little swimming? I swam around the island for about three hours. That's too obvious for me not to comment on. That's definitely not a little swimming. That definitely sounds like somebody I know. Why were you already swimming? You guys are about to swim now, right? Isn't that why you're all meeting up? It wasn't for my enjoyment. I was trying to see if I could swim to a different island. 
Huh? But I couldn't find any other islands. It seems it may be difficult to leave this island by swimming. If you didn't see anything after you swam for three hours, it's more than difficult. It's impossible. Yeah, that may be true. Hey. Hey, hi, May. Hmm, what? Awesome! A woman with wet, slick back hair is pretty fine too, huh? Oh my my! And this body too, man. Young ladies are sure well endowed nowadays. Is that a challenge against all the women in the world? Fine. Ibuki accepts that challenge with the power of technology. Time to pump these puppies full of silicone. No, no, Ibuki. No, no. Thank you, Pekko. <laughs> anyway, it looks like everyone's almost here and it's already past four o'clock. If so, all the time is left I'm is... I'm terribly sorry for my delays. <sighs> Miss Sonia's here! He doubled down on the excitement. <gasps> all right, what kind of sexy swimsuit is Miss Sonia going to be wearing? Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! That's what you get! That's what you get! <laughs> Let's go, Sonya! Freaking Kazuichi! All he wanted was to see the stupid stuff and be a stupid, and I am so glad that, like, this is what his con- This is the consequence of his actions, honestly. He freaking deserves this. However, as I have never worn a wetsuit before, I had a hard time putting it on, which resulted in my delays. <laughs> oh, the first time full in full coverage gear. <laughs> really? It is my bad. No, it is not your bad, Sonia. I freaking appreciate you for this. This is a glowing review and moment for you. I see, a wetsuit. Well, Miss Sonia does have beautiful white skin. But that tight outfit of hers is amazing and just what I expect 100% purebred princesses to wear. He was quick to recover. I mean, he was. Um, anyway, um, why are you two here? Uh. I'll answer that, Miss Sonia. I'll be honest, if I were going to go to the beach, or if you're going to go to the beach, please let us come with you. Well, it was originally supposed to be a girls-only outing to strengthen our friendships with each other. Do you think you can make an exception? Pretty, pretty, please! Um, it's okay. It's not like there'd be any problems, even if there were some boys. You're right. They came all this way here. It would be bad if we made them leave. Uh, Miss Sonia, you're too kind! All right, now it's decided. Let's get going. But Akane's wounds are still being treated. Shut up! Shut up! There's no way I can stand around. I'll go ahead and prepare. I'll set up at the parasol, prepare, prepare the drinks. Engines revving. I mean it. I promise I'll give you my all and serve you, or serve you so everyone can have fun. With an abnormal amount of gusto, he bolted out of the diner. Um, I'm surrounded by girls in swimsuits. This is a little awkward. Uh, I should go help Kazuichi too. As I mumbled my excuse, I ran out of the diner and almost as if I were escaping. He definitely didn't want to do this. Which, I guess I, I definitely applaud him for that. Now, whether that was out of awkwardness, or if that was out of... I don't... Oh, what? 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 I don't like that sound. That's a body... That's, that's the body discovery announcement. No, 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 no. Just amount of time has passed. The class trial will begin. What? A, a body? That's a lie. It's impossible. Someone, someone, come here! Oh, Kazuichi found it. Sounds like he's nearby. Oh god. No 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 Okay. 
Oh god, Nekamaru was near. Nekamaru was near. Nekamaru was near. Nekamaru was near. No, 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 there's no reason to be nervous. A body discovery announcement. I won't believe it. I'm not going to believe it. There's no way I'm going to believe it. Who would do something like that? As I raise my voice, I simply step inside the beach house. Nekamaru, no, 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 no. I won't believe it. The moment I step inside the beach house, the words mercilessly shattered into pieces. It's a bat. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, it's a female. That's why she wasn't found. No. Okay, if this was a dream, when did I, when did I begin dreaming? If this is a reality, why is Mihiru on the floor covered in blood? I couldn't understand that, but, but that was in front of me. And I couldn't believe in anything. Uh Oh no. Mahiru Koizumi, the ultimate photographer. She had an unyielding force of a personality, but she was actually very good at taking care of people. Yeah. So that's why, oh, I should have thought about that. That's why Hiyoko was crying, because, like, that's her girl. So she was the first one to find it. And then... Kazuichi found it. And then the killer... Whoever that was... Well, technically it would be one, two, and then Kazuichi. Which... I, th I do not think... You Yoko would have done anything and I don't and I'm I'm we were with Kazuichi the whole time so I'm fine with that was it a Kane was it actually Nekamaru there's no way he I who the heck had problems with Mahiru I don't know. I loved her. I know. I'm getting mad over this. I'm actually mad over this death. Um, because I really loved her forceful personality. She's like, yes, she was forceful. Yes, she was direct. But she also, oh. And she was always so straightforward. Yeah, exactly. You knew what she was doing and where she was going to go and how everything was going to happen. Towards us, towards herself. She was always facing forward. She was that kind of person. So why her? Why Mihiru? Why? Why did this happen to her? The muscles of my face stiffened as I grew hard. Darkness clouded my vision. My legs started to wobble as I instinctively placed my hand against the wall. Damn it! Hey, hi, Ma. Before this, we had we were having a great time, right? We were excited about going to the beach. We were having lots of fun. But why? Are you kidding me? Why did something like this happen? Someone tell me. Obviously, I'm not going to know the what's going on either. Huh. Um. Yeah. Exactly. Now is not the time to make bubbles. Hurry and get the others. Ibuki instantly left the beach house. I am sure it took some time for everyone else to come here. They had to change and whatnot, and it must have taken some time. But I didn't really know how bad how much time had passed my senses were numbed my emotions emotions were also numbed within me were various layers that were peeling off my senses started to return around the time i realized that the others were already here huh? what the hell is this <coughs> why am a hero the girls stand, were standing outside the door leading to the beach their faces pale with terror Don't be like this. but for heaven's sakes what in the world is going on 
With their pale faces still intact, the girls began wobbling towards the beach house until a voice stopped. Hold, it. Huh. Hold on a second. Mm. Those things beneath you. Be careful not to step on them. What? Beneath? See? You know, the footprints in front of the door. Oh, those are little footprints. The footprints leading, leading out of the beach house is probably an important clue. So don't step on them. Huh? If you mean evidence... Monokuma mentioned it in an announcement, right? After a certain amount of time, we'll hold a class trial. Another class trial? Serious? Then, are you saying this is... That's right! That's right! What if you guys have killed her? Right. Can I get killed? That's impossible. Hey, hey. It's not like an accident or something? Like... If you guys think it, that's an accident, that still means a death was caused by someone else's actions, right? In other words... This also counts as a legitimate murder. No, such death falls into the gray area on this island. I will make sure it's clear to you guys. On this island, dying from sickness is basically the only death that is not considered a murder. <laughs> well, it is impossible to get sick and die on this island. Not when Monami takes such good care of people. What's this? Oh, speaking of which... There it is, the silent treatment attack. Is this like the number one thing that hurts me? Well, fine, I'm not gonna lose to your bashing. I've decided to become a tough kid. This is the worst. Once again, this horrible nightmare. Another victim, and it's all because of Monokuma. No Jeez, uh, it's not my fault. Huh, then whose fault is it, you, if you ask? To find out, we hold the class trial. So, let's begin already. No whining, just begin already. <laughs> this should be starting to feel familiar. Now best. then, do your very best to investigate. I'll see you later at the class trial. <laughs> Cla class trial investigation. This is horrible. It is just too horrible. Hey. Then you should have stopped the murder before it occurred. Don't you have that kind of power? I did have the power before he appeared. Perhaps. Even if she tried to stop it, judging from Monokuma and Monami's relationship, there's no doubt she'd have stopped. She'd get stopped herself. <laughs> yes, Monokuma took everything away, including my magic stick and the surveillance cameras. The only thing that I can rely on are these ears, but they can only hear about three times that of a normal person. Basically. You have no idea what's happening on this island in the first place. <laughs> I'm just the worst. A powerless rabbit like me is the worst. Hey, now is not the time to focus on something like that. More importantly, what should we do? Hey, do we have to do it again? The, the, the cruel thing. Do we have to do it again? Why? I cannot believe it. Mahira was killed by one of us. Damn it. Yeah, I can't do this anymore. Investigating the class trials. Seriously, I'm done. Everyone feels the same, but we can't do anything else except do it. And there's no way we can just ignore it. The reason the hero was killed. Hey. Yeah, the only thing we can do is investigate. Bad. Because we should never forgive that. Killing is someone we should something we should never forgive. Chiaki. Well? The killer has their reasons, and I understand that. It was the same for Teru Teru as well. It's really all Monokuma's fault, and I understand that as well. But even so... Killing. We should never we'll forgive never killing. She usually has her head in the clouds, so for her to say something like that, she can't forgive us at all. But that's true of me as well. Understood. Regardless, everyone is going to die if we don't do it. So in order for us to survive, we must. Then let's do it! Perhaps. Mihiro probably wants us to do this too. She would want us to reveal the truth behind her death. <laughs> I, I, I understand if... Uh, Everyone else is doing it. I will too do it. But, but please give me a little time. Please, give me time to calm myself down a little. Also, I will go do. I will go tell the others, who aren't here about this. You're right. If all of you heard, if all you heard was the announcement, you won't know where the murder took place. <laughs> I I shall excuse myself for now. Hey. Then let's begin. Who killed Mahiru Kozu Koizumi? Why she was killed? <laughs> We gotta find out and solve this already. That's right, we have to do it. It's the only way. I don't want to do this, but 
there's more a reason for us to finish this. And I'm the only one who can do this. First, I need to take a look at the Monokuma file. The victim was Mahiru Kazumi. Estimated time of death was around 3 p.m. The scene of the crime where the body is discovered is inside the beach house at Chandler Beach. The cause of death was a single killing blow to the head with a blunt instrument. There was no other conspicu conspicuous external injuries and no trace of foreign substances such as drugs. Around 3 p.m., that's the time that Kazuichi and I arrived at the diner. Then, if we had just gone to the beach house instead... No. Now is not the time to feel regret. I need to focus on doing as much as I can right now. And then I'm going to find out the truth behind Mihiru's death. That's the only way the rest of us can survive. And th oh, there's one. Okay, no. And we'll find out and investigate all of our truth bullets and try and find all of them in the next episode. Thank you guys so very much for watching this. I cannot believe that one of that's finally kind of one of my top characters going down. Which sucks, because it's like, you know, you never want to see your top characters go down, but it was going to happen eventually, when I, especially now that I'm starting to like a lot of the characters. And knowing that I was with Kazuichi, I knew he wasn't going to die, so I was like, frick. Because um, Kazuichi is like one of the few characters I don't necessarily like uh, at this current moment. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you guys so very much, and we'll see you guys in the next episode.